word, isn't it? All right, the lower one. one. About the little unicorn that could. He couldn't. I don't want to spoil the ending, but it's 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 not a happy tale. So this is Fable Dom Demo. See, I've been reading some stuff about this for some time. It seems kind of promising. And we're gonna find out in a moment if it is. Uh, very light graphic settings. Not much we can do here. I think we're gonna leave it as it is. Might turn down narration a bit. We could do it maybe like this. Turn it to 40. Then bump that up. Okay, a uh, new game. Ah, it's a story you want. Uh, choose your realm. Before the story can begin, you need to choose which realm you want it to take place in. Uh, click any realm on the map uh, to view its properties. To generate a new map, click the dice at the top left uh, of your screen or enter a custom Could I seed. Perhaps interest you in some vintage rainwater? Freshly skimmed? Vintage rainwater sounds lovely. Right, so we have uh, one, uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Did I count that right? Nine. We have nine. Uh, so yeah, creative is unavailable during the demo. Well, let's press on this one. Uh, realm size large, ocean large, hills several and dense forests. Uh, large, medium, hills, few, dense forest, ocean, large, light forest, but several hills, few hills, normal forest, medium, medium, okay, what about here, medium, I mean, I, I think a large realm would be ideal, right? Medium, medium, medium. Hmm. Well, uh, okay, just for now then, let's go for this. Because we have large ocean, few hills, and dense forests. That sounds lovely. Uh, I am a prince looking for a princess. My name is... Arahor. And, um. I place. And let's go. Or shall we dice one more time? Okay, then we get a complete different. Um, with different names and everything, actually. Uh, a dense forest. Wouldn't you like an island? An island would be nice. Like this, sort of, but... Uh, with uh, little hills and... Uh, 
It's a dense forest. Let's try a few more. Let's see if we can find something similar to that. This is not. So yeah, we're going with standard, of course. We don't have another choice. Build and manage your kingdom, explore your realm to find new secrets and uh, rule through love or war. Look at that. that isn't that amazing? That little place. <laughs> Oh wait, we can uh, we can uh, change the name of it. Okay, well let's. Uh, oh, it's a light forest. Uh, but it's uh, it's so small. This will be perfect. This will be the kingdom. Ah, uh, sir. I was not ready for the name of kingdom. If I change this right something, does that change on the map? No, it doesn't. Okay, this will be, uh, be this will be Kittenton. He did change the name. <coughs> Once upon a time it goes, a story told of love and woes. When all the kings and queens of yore sent forth their children to explore. New lands of plenty, fields and trees, fertile, yielding, birds and bees. It's your turn, prince or princess you. Discover, conquer, daring do. Remember, friend, tis not just sword that makes one lady or a lord. To build a kingdom tis an art, but don't neglect your spirit's heart. Through love or war these lands ignited shall ever after be united. Now go, be kind, be cruel, be scrappy, and make your ever after happy. I think we can afford to tune that up a little bit more. Chapter one, a new beginning. I hope they will not scare us. Uh, objectives. First step. Move camera. Done. Zoom in. Zoom out. Rotate camera. 
Uh, like that. And we get some coins. Where were we? Oh, yes. Our kingdom began with little more than a humble laborer's... Uh, hold on. You can actually be a little bit louder as well now. Damn it. He, he stopped talking. Uh, build a road, build a laborer's hut, and assign a laborer. Okay, uh, we can zoom in just to show uh, the, the cute graphics here. We cannot rename the peasants. <laughs> uh, the thing is that the, the fun part with games that can, you can actually rena uh, rename them whatever you like. It becomes a little bit more personal. So maybe you can later down. But I... Oh, what's that? Hold on, set home. No. I can't do that. But that's fine. Ah, look at you. Look at that mustache. And your potato ears. It's almost like a potato head. Alright, so they want a road. They want a hut. Uh, let's play. What's, what the hell is that? That's a ruin. Okay, well, let's place it over here. Oh. I thought it was going to be more like a home, but okay. A workplace requires Fablings to operate. You can assign Fablings by clicking on the available plus slots or clicking manage workers. Fair enough. Roads. They will follow their roads to their best ability. Connecting roads to the blue arrow indicates will help guide them. Okay. So. Our first road in Kittenton. Uh, right. So uh, we need um, a sign. We are signing two people here. Manage workers, okay. Claim. Now they want us to... Um, uh, build a homestead. Build two homestead attachments inside the new garden. Some buildings use foundations and attachments. After placing the homestead, hold and drag to place the foundation. Attachment are placed automatically by default. If you prefer, you can disable that fe uh, feature and place them manually. It's a very relaxing soundtrack. Is where your fablings live and eat. 
a head of household is required for the homestead to operate smoothly. Now, make sure one has been assigned, won't you? Uh, yes, of course. Uh, okay, now we're all done. We unlocked a lot of stuff now. Uh, right, nice. Uh, okay, so homestead. A residence requires a head of household to operate. You can assign one by clicking manage household. If the fabling can... If the fabling that takes up residency has no job, it will be assigned automatically. A head of household will make sure the home is stocked with food and other uh, resources required to keep the fablings happy. Alright. So we can attachments. Uh, do, I, do I need to do so? Okay, wait, claim. Uh, I'm gonna do that. Manage. Head of house pool is William Cosimo. And here is Jane Nielsen. Desirability is a well and uh, a doghouse. They have a doghouse. Oh, I see. Okay, so we can... Okay. And then uh, we will make a well. Some bills only affect uh, a specific area. Okay, I think I think I understand. Yeah, yeah, I understand it. Okay, that's good to know. So in theory, we can actually place this stuff, um, and uh, we can place it. I mean, they just want. Um, they don't need to cover everything, right? They just need to cover. The house itself. But sure, we can make this a little neighborhood. Let's place this stuff here. Some buildings require upkeep to stay in good condition. To see where the next payment is due, hover over the coin icon at the top of your screen. Next payment is in two days. Can I move stuff? Locate. Oh, destroy. Attachments. Okay, we're just gonna have it like that then. Camera speed? What? Oh, I like that. Yeah, but no, 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 no. No, no, no. We are gonna have it like this instead. Camera speed. Left shift. Play several. Uh, no. Let's not, uh, let's not do that. Zero speed will be space. It's not a big map. But now I know how small oh, that is. Finally, here come our first newcomers. As long as you keep your population happy, more will want to join. As long as there is room, of course. Welcome, welcome. Okay, that's nice. So they now need somewhere to live. Unemployed too. Newcomers in Tay Day in ten days. Okay. No, we don't need another one, do we? Because the households uh, can keep uh, three, right? Or two, is it two? No, they just have the same name. Do they? William, William, yeah. 
so, um... Yeah, they, there's no one who's homeless. Uh, build a farm. Sweet. This place is sad somewhere. Uh, like, um... This can't be right. It seems you got a letter from a secret admirer. Oh, That's this, right. Well, I suppose there's no accounting for taste. They're just joshing. <laughs> you can open it by clicking the letter icon at the top center of your screen. You will let me know if there's anything good. I don't. I don't get out much anymore. It has to be inside this area. But how do we... I mean, I want the crop on the... Like, behind it. Let's try there. Crops will grow with time as as long as there is at least one farmer is assigned to the farm. All crops will die when winter arrives. Sign a farmer. Ralph will take care of it. Uh, build a lumber camp. There. Uh, we have a bunch of wood over here. This mess. Oh, what the hell? Hold on. Let's stay house. No, okay, okay. We need houses. Um. I hope they can build it and then we can accept them. Uh, Arboretha. There is springs, my son, my spring. Such a splendid land this is. Undulating hills and wide fertile plains. It is the dream of our ancestors. I wish to make this land into a paradise, but I cannot do it on my own. Your dashing countenance is all ready to talk of this land. Shall we meet? Could be a scam. This is like medieval Tinder. Uh, assign a woodcutter. Oh, yeah, damn, hold on. There we go. A woodcutter. 
Uh, so that, we can do that from here too, right? No available. Claim, place three decorations. Do we have that? Decorations. Uh, an outhouse would be very good to have, really. Okay. Uh, we're really low on money. Uh, reach population milestone hamlet. So we need to get to 10. Welcome. We should have done it now if I wouldn't have messed up there with the houses. Now we are broke. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Assign a worker. So they're growing. Pumpkins. Alright. Milestone reached. 
Uh, goodness gracious, we already managed to find enough fablings brave enough to trust us with their livelihood to call ourselves a hamlet. Uh, buy new territories to expand your kingdom reach. Zero new territory allowed. In a nice place to rest after work. Can only operate if there is food available in the storage. That building. It wasn't even built yet. We're just going with two. Wish we can get rid of this one. Coal maker stone cam. We have stone here, we have stone here too, actually. Okay. Provide storage for food, especially useful in winter. I don't think we need that right now, do we? Seven days. Uh, the inn would be a nice addition. I want to place that here. It would be great to have it here. Actually, damn that stockpile messed things up a bit, but I can still have it here, if uh, the wagon disappears. Or there maybe. Select a lumber camp to build a forester. Thank you. 
Uh, preparing for the winter. Produce 15 coal in a coal maker. Uh, granary, okay. So let's welcome them. There. And um, we need two more stone. Yeah, that damn well. Ah, the trusty village inn. Oh, a personal favorite. <laughs> I've got some stories for later. Anyway, the inn adds happiness to its surroundings. The happier your kingdom is, the more newcomers it will attract. Then we didn't get any refund that money. That's a shame. Oh no, come on, don't, don't do that. Oh no, okay. I mean, it looks fine. That, that blue dot should be red, in my opinion. If you cannot build anything there. It's kind of misleading right now. Uh, what do we do then? Then maybe it's gonna have to be like that. Let's fix the road first. Where's that? Uh, negative. Yeah, we know. We know. Uh, that's where we're gonna place it. Far away. Like, um. Like all the way up here in the corner.
Uh oh. There we go, we have an in. Does the water freeze or... I think I sped up. I was a little bit too comfortable speeding up. Uh, let's just try this one over here then. Amenities. Amenities add happiness to its surrounding as long as at least one fabling is assigned as a worker. Yep. Got it. When are we gonna get more? Four days. Uh, okay, you. Get over here. Overview intro. The overview menu is a great tool for managing your realm as it starts to grow. From here, you can get an overview of your fablings, workplaces, and more. Uh, tabs, uh, yeah, workplaces, and I can see how many they are, like we can have one more here, we know, and one here, and history log, yeah, okay. Secret Santa needs your attention. Um, accept gift, oh. Secret Santa, what a childish game. It is below me and my stature. Unfortunately for you, I wasn't given any instructions, so enjoy this. You deserve it. We got some coal. We are saved. Wait, what's this? Oh shit, no, we need to place it somewhere. Here. Uh, milestone reached. A new popula population milestone has been reached. Well done. Uh, you can now call ourselves a village. We can now call ourselves a village. Uh, nobility. Nobility can be used as a currency for special actions and items. It also influences some interactions with other rulers. Territories. Fisherman's hut unavailable during demo. Sawmill. Uh, street theater. Messenger's guild. Windmill and bakery. Understood. We're finally finishing that well. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we cannot expand uh, our, the size of our land. Because of... Um, it's a demo, but uh, at least we get to try it out uh, decently, in my opinion. And uh, so far, I actually do like it. I don't think we can have enough. I don't think we have enough coal. Hmm. We 
might need a second one. Out there. Oh, look, my wand has shrunk. It's done, and um, uh, beggars. Uh, Prince Arrow plays. Times have been hard. We tried our best to put food on the table, but are out of options. We heard of your good heart and decided to swallow our pride. And come here to beg you to help us, please. No, learn to fend for yourselves. Uh, how much do they want? They want 30 veg. I oh, will have a lot of it. Here, take it. It's fine. We can afford it. Hmm. Some more houses. There's one more house. Yeah, we cannot place that here. Nice. Shouldn't need to do that though. melting we survived our first winter lovely it's 
Select a Fabling using the overview menu. That's done. Um We are actually running out of planks. Uh, demo population uh, limit reached. You have reached the population limit for the demo, meaning no more newcomers will join your realm. To finish the demo, keep playing until you finish the quest titled Greetings. Okay. Uh, purchase new territory in your toolbar there. So this is how we expand. And... Uh, uh, we have pig herd over here. We have uh, lots of trees. Iron deposits. Uh, ruins that way. Lots of trees. Sheep herd. And trees. Uh, prices is just the same. So I'm gonna go for this. And there we go. Well, let's continue till we have finished uh, the demo at least. But we have reached uh, the population limit. So that's good. Messenger Guild. Thank you. 
Right now we need to wait. Uh, but I do want to prioritize this first. So we finally have that done. Uh, immigrants in need. Uh, your grace, we have recently left our own realm due to the horrible condition we were forced to live in. We were hoping to settle here with you. However, we could use some coin to help us um, uh, get, to help get us started. We promise to work hard. Um, we're gonna hand over 200 coins for two. I don't like your look, boss. Uh, postpone. Well, okay, then go, go ahead. We need a workforce. And we have the houses, so it's fine. I mean, they are actually building, they're they not pr uh, prioritizing this, are they? Okay, there are also one just delivered something. Also delivering to this one instead of everyone just delivering to the street theater. We need one more to finish it. Done that. There we go. That will make people happy. Okay, they've added some uh, fake figures here, okay, that's fine. Okay, final mission. Uh, sent out a messenger to another realm using the newly unlocked world map. Once the messenger has arrived, greet the ruler of the newly discovered realm. Okay, uh, how do I do that? The, the world map is used to interact with other rulers, complete missions and more. Click any occupied realm to get started. Only two realms are occupied during the demo. Realms with names are occupied and can be selected. Okay, well, we are in Kittenton, of course. Uh, let's just send them over to the realm next to us. What can happen? 
and done. Six days remaining. Perfect. Let's just speed up. There's not really much we can do right now, I believe. Our beautiful little uh, village is about to come to an end. I would really like to see what this ruin was, though. Encounters. Spread across the realm on different encounters. These encounters can only be interacted with using your hero. Uh, not available during, during demo. Okay. That seems interesting. Uh, farmers have reported issues with swarms of red-winged fairies spreading in their crops. Uh, they worry that if we do not address the issue, we risk losing some valuable food sources. Uh, don't worry, I'll send some help. I'm sure it's not that bad. Let's find an exterminator. Chapter 2. Meet Cute. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, hello, neighbor. Are you here to make a deal? I'll draft up some paperwork. Uh, choose a greeting. A pleasure to meet you. Please accept this gift as a token of my friendship. Uh, well met. I look forward to getting to know you and learning more about your kingdom. Let's give them some gifts. Uh, each realm has a ruler with their own personality. Missions and rewards. To learn more about the ruler, click the information uh, button next to their avatar. Uh, you have a relationship with each ruler that is affected by your interactions. Some interactions require a specific relationship level, uh, for example, to start courting. You need to first be friends. Uh, okay. Spy requires an embassy. Uh, rich in love, the merchant prince. All tax services are increased by one coin without affecting happiness. Sporting gifts, dice table, and a crown. Hmm. Wave. Oh, drat! Your story was just getting started. Oh, but it doesn't end here. <laughs> Listen to this. Let me tell you a story you cannot resist. Of bandits dissed, of sweethearts kissed. Endless twists you cannot miss when you wish upon a list. <laughs> I won Fabled and Idle with that one. Uh, well, thank you for playing and come back soon. Uh, and when you do, uh, maybe bring soup or uh, something warm to eat. I'm so lonely. Right. Okay. Well, that was pretty good. Uh, thank you so much for playing our demo. We're aiming for an EA release in spring 2023. Uh, the EA will include several new features such as courting champions, fantasy encounters, new structures, and more. Uh, that took us about an hour. But yeah, I did, uh, I did like that. I mean, uh, I wouldn't call it simple. It was, uh, I mean, it looked very cute. There's not a lot of, uh, the, like different models there's only two really i don't but it's not something you think about at least i didn't think about it when i, I was playing so that's nice uh, i already have it wish list actually had for some time so um 
That's good. Uh, I don't know why they keep showing us this, because... I don't know. They were showing us the same kind of, like, tutorial. For everything it felt like. It didn't really make sense. Maybe I didn't pay attention to it. Yeah, but either way, I did, I did, I did like it. I like uh, games like this. It's uh, very, it can be very relaxing. So that's nice. Uh, all right. So uh, we are definitely going to be keeping an eye on this game. And um, I cannot say if we will play right on the, the early access release. It really depends on how much content usually an early access have. If um, if it is heavy limited, if if there are some heavy limitations, uh, then we might push it a little bit. Otherwise, it's gonna be like, oh, you now we've done everything. Now we're gonna take a break. We're gonna come back in a few months time and then continue, and then we're gonna pretty much have to start over to learn everything. If it's like early access, like how Ark was, that's a completely different story then. Because uh, that that was probably one of the best early accesses I have ever played. But they were showering the game with patches and, and uh, content updates. It was insane. So, um, uh, we will see. We're definitely going to keep an eye on this. It's not the only management game we have uh, on our watch list. There is uh, a few more, but it's def this is probably definitely the most cutest of them all. So I'm eager to see more of it. Uh, okay, uh, we're gonna be swapping over to uh, Recipe for Disaster and uh, see how that is. I mean, we are now proving we can run a town. Now we're gonna see if we can run a kitchen. <laughs> 